Hi everyone, welcome. I'm Eva Matejska and I'm a technical program manager on the TensorFlow team. I'm Lu, an, a software engineer from TensorFlow Lite. What are you going to be showing us today, Lu? And I like to show you guys the TensorFlow Lite example apps. Uh, TensorFlow Lite built more than 10 example apps that shows not only how to use a model, but uh, for end-to-end -end code that a developer would need to write. Uh, where can I find the source code for, the, for these models? Uh, you can check out all the examples and code from our website, tensorflow.org slash light slash examples. And those examples are uh, works for cross-platform, for example, Android, iOS, Raspberry Pi, and even HTBU. Okay, awesome. I'm excited to see some of these. Absolutely. So I'm going to show you three um, example apps today. Mm -hmm. um, before I go in deep into each of yeah. them, I like to point out that the devices right now is on airplane mode, uh, which means the TFLite model is running purely on device without talking to any servers. That's great. So th does that mean I don't have to worry about privacy? Exactly. So the user privacy is greatly protected. Oh, fantastic. Uh, let's go into the first app. It's a question and answer Android app. What model does that use? It's powered by MobileBird. So Mobile Birds reads an article and it can answer a given question based okay. on the articles. Would cool. you like to try an article first? Sure. Let's try the Amazon Rainforest one. Okay. And would you like to ask a question there? OK. What is the size of the Amazon Rainforest? Let's see if it figures that out. 5,500,000 square kilometers. That's pretty big. Nice. <laughs> so Mobile Bird is able to return the correct answer in just the 70 millisecond. That's awesome. And why did you choose this app to, to create as a model? Yeah, so um, it, demonstrate, it actually demonstrates the power of TF Lite. So TF Lite is, uh, has been spent a significant effort to support all those state-of-the-art models, such as Bird, Mobile Bird, Distilled Bird, Elbert, and Efficient Ad. Do you have any uh, apps to show me that work on iOS? Uh, yeah, the second app I'd like to show is the PostNet. It's actually available for both Android and iOS. Okay. So the version we're looking at here is the iOS app. Uh, so PostNet, uh, it continuously detects the up to 17 key points of a person in real time. Would you like to uh, try it out? Sure. You want me to point this at you? Sure. Okay. Hey, I see circles, I see lines. Wow, how, how is it doing it so fast um, in real time? It runs TFY interpreter with Core ML Delegate, which greatly accelerates the performance. OK, cool. That's pretty fast. Yes. Um, let me show you a third app, which is the uh, style transfer. It takes a content image and a style image, and then outputs a stylized image based okay. on the uh, specified styles. That's pretty neat. Yeah. Would you, you want like me to, to try it? On you? Yeah. You can right. try it. Take a picture of me. Let me take a picture. All right. I have a picture. Which style are you going to pick for me? Uh, what style would you like? You want uh, Starry Night? Yeah. Ah, there you are. Cool. That's yeah. pretty neat. That's good. That's cool. Uh, how can I find out more? Yeah. If you like to see more examples, feel free to visit our website at tensorflow.org slash light slash examples. There's a lot more code, documentations, and examples available. And also, if you like to download the purchasing models, feel free to visit TF Hub. Okay. Awesome. Thank you so much. Thank and you. thank you for joining us. Thanks. Thanks.